Electric vehicles continue to be all the rage for auto fanatics. We saw that at the auto show. Now a proposed Illinois law wants to make EVs more accessible to the average Joe. Morning Insider Lauren Victory is taking us through legislation that gets specific about electric vehicle charging. The acceleration is crazy. CBS2 went for a spin in Art Friedson's new electric vehicle. The ride is like a dream. But a bit of a nightmare is where Friedson needs to plug in his battery. To the local supermarket where they have a commercial charging station. A whole trip to Whole Foods. That's not what Friedson expected, since his neighbors have their own EV chargers that they installed in a Lakeview garage they all share. This is exactly what I thought I would do in my space, but um, they were concerned that we didn't have enough juice in the building. The Electric Vehicle Charging Act is meant to provide relief, calling for various mandates in Illinois as more and more EVs hit our roads. My experience hearing from constituents about this is what's encouraging me. State Senator Sarah Feigenholz is the bill's sponsor. This is a piece of legislation that sort of lays the groundwork about the right to charge. For example, tenants would have the right to ask for an EV plug. Then landlords have the right to make the requesting renter pay for installation. Another requirement, developers of new residential buildings or single family homes would need to provide conduit tubing that protects and routes wires to establish framework for possible future EV parking spots. We have rolled a lot of things out of this bill that were um, rejected. The original bill required condo buildings doing major renovation work to revamp for EV parking. That got some resistance, so it's now out. There's also been pushback around cost. The proposal does not require builders to pay for wiring or the actual charging device. Remember, the law would mandate conduit only and stipulates the timing during construction. The range can be from like $50 to $200 but hundreds, if not thousands, if you have to do trenching after a building's been done. Feigenholz calls it a very basic bill. And someday... For a basic task that more and more constituents... My own charger. ...are needing to do at home. Lauren Victory, CBS2 News. The state Senate could vote on the Electric Vehicle Charging Act as soon as this week.